dangerous here. I just took my ground wire off so that everybody knows that energy's not coming. Ah, damn it! Here I am again. I tripped over my ground rod again, so I, this is real dangerous. That's why uh, I say don't do this at home. Anyway, I, I took my ground wire off so that you can see. It ain't no wires tracking back. You see them lights on up there. And my ground wire's back now. Watch them lights flicker. Try to get a damn good view on here. ground wire again. Urgh! If you ain't really careful you'll get your crud shocked out of yourself and possibly even killed because we're looking at some serious voltage here. Gotta keep putting my ground wire back on because I keep knocking it loose. That it's transmitting that, that electricity through the air up there at the uh, fluorescent bulbs, exciting the gas. Of course, this is a crude model, but essentially, this is what HARP does. It uh, basically uh, excites the uh, all the atoms and up in the atmosphere and does what it does. Alrighty. That no ground. Uh, I better put my ground wire back on for a minute. Uh, here we go. Got a ground wire now. See that? It's a serious voltage. That's why I say do not do this at home. Alright, enough of that. Keep in mind. Okay, that's it. You can see that last part there where the uh, camera freaked out, man. And uh, your guess is as good as mine. Uh, you know, it's just an experiment that went bad, <laughs> and I ain't never repeating it again. So, uh, all I can say is, uh, harp technology's real. Old tested technology works, and uh, you just got to be careful because 
man, you don't know what the heck you're doing. I mean, uh, I had one uh, really vivid hallucination. So uh, apparently I must have got the living crap shocked out of myself. And, uh, dude, <laughs> I don't know if I mentioned in part one, but the uh, during my hallucination, the uh, Egyptian guy on the uh, hovering platform was speaking in some weird language. But the strange thing is, I understood every damn thing he was saying. And apparently he was pissed off. So apparently this is technology that's getting buried with me because I'm tearing it apart, dismantling it, and spreading all the parts to all four points of the compass. And uh, that's that. I'll work on some uh, alternative energy, but I'm going to be a whole lot more careful when it comes to anything related to harp or that kind of jazz. Uh, I may give up on Tesla technology and try some of my own stuff. I'm always blowing something up in the lab anyway. I either start a fire or shock the living crap out of myself. And apparently, uh, whenever I took that ground wire off, I must have got a bit too close to it or whatever. I don't know what happened, but I lost an hour's worth of time. And I've been running around like I'm all jacked up on coffee, about a million gallons of coffee or whatever. Um, that's all I got to say on that subject. Uh, you see basically how HARP works whenever the uh, antenna rays bounce up off the clouds or the upper ionosphere then come down and reflect off the clouds. They uh, excite all the gases and everything and uh, cause them to do what they do. And uh, so for all those skeptics out there, hey, you know, try it yourself. <laughs> now seriously, uh, don't try this at home because it's not safe. You're jacking around with high voltages and uh, apparently uh, hallucination possibilities. Uh, there's possibilities of death. Uh, there's, it's just not a good thing. So I'm going to leave it at that. and uh, You guys can have fun with this video and uh, scrutinize it and uh, believe Shaziz Dunn went insane. <laughs> Uh, maybe I was laying on the floor for an hour, I don't know, but at that particular point when I was trying to get a good camera view down there, you seen everything went to hell in a hand basket real fast, and that was uh, that. Was that. And the last thing I remember was uh, putting the battery back in the uh, camera and, uh, uh, you know, that kind of jazz, or putting the battery back in the camera bag. <laughs> Anyway, I remember the hallucination real well. I mean, it was like a movie, but it was an intense movie. All right, well, that's the end of that. That's uh, my mini harp. So, uh, like I say, uh, don't try this at home. And if you do, then uh, uh, I don't know what to tell you. Man. <laughs> uh, it's just not cool. Peace.